Hello everybody. I've come outside to talk about all the things that we can hear in the garden and all the different sounds and even music. You can hear all, I, I'm coming out today because I can hear all the birds singing and I wanted to, for you to hear some of the things as well and a very special sound that you don't hear very often. So I'm going to be very quiet for a minute and let the sound record so you can hear. And I'm going to put my finger up when I hear the particular sound that I wanted you to hear. Did you hear that? If you want, you can listen to the recording back again and listen very carefully. See how many different birds you can hear. And then if you hear that sound, I'll stop if I hear it again. There it is. Do you know what that is? That's a woodpecker. He's tapping away on a piece of wood that, is make, that he's found that is going to make a really good sound and carry a long way so other woodpeckers can hear it. Can we hear it again? There he goes again. So why don't you go out into your garden, or stand just outside your door and just be very quiet for a few minutes and listen to all the different sounds that you can hear and see how many different birds you can hear as well. Let's wait until, see, can we hear him again? No, that was my dog. There he is again. Okay, bye bye woodpecker. I wonder, could we think of the different birds that we can hear singing and making noise and see if we can make sounds like that with our voices? Here are some of the birds that I can hear in my garden and the sounds that they make. Here's a picture of a woodpecker. Can you make the noise of him tapping on the wood with your voice? He went like this, didn't he? There's a blue tit. A blackbird, a wood pigeon, a swallow, and I sometimes hear a cuckoo. Let's see if we can make the bird sounds to go with the pictures this time. <laughs> Don't the birds have lots of different types of songs and sounds? See how many you can hear and have fun trying to sing like a bird. Bye for now.